What up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you clever and important claymore spots you need to use in your ranked matches no matter what rank. This video will be split into two parts and this is the first part where there will be six different claymore spots and in the next video there will be five. So make sure you subscribe and turn notifications on to know when the next part of this video is going to come out. Some of these spots are quite clever and some of these spots cover a lot of very common runouts. So first we have a very clever claymore spot on Cafe. A lot of people would know that defenders normally flank up red stairs to try get you if you're in Cigar Lounge or Bonus Hatch, trying to attack the third floor objective. A good claymore spot I found out is that if you break one of the vases on the red stairs, it's the same colour as the claymore. So if you put it within the broken vase, the laser doesn't show much either, considering the carpet's red. Not many people spot this claymore at all, which is why it's so clever. And the reason why people don't normally notice this is because they're normally looking up the red stairs at the exit in the cigar lounge. Our next claymore spot is in Chalet. This next claymore spot is when you're trying to hard breach snowmobile garage. This is probably the most common run out on Chalet and probably my highest kill claymore. If you place a claymore outside as well, the lasers are hardly ever visible, especially in the snow on Chalet. Personally, I like to use this for when I'm droning into the snowmobile garage as Twitch to try to destroy bandits or kids. And as you can see there, the laser on the claymore is hardly visible at all. This next claymore is on Clubhouse. So if you're trying to attack CCTV in cash room from outside through the breachable wall, a lot of defenders will notice this and they'll probably try to run out of garage. The thing is with the garage door, it's right on the corner of a room, so there's a certain way you can place the claymore to make it so only one laser is visible. And like I said before, since it's outside, it's hardly ever visible. And another reason why they won't see it is because they'll be looking up towards the breachable wall into CCTV. And another reason why I'd place it on the left of the door, if you're looking at the door from the outside, is because they're going to have to look right if they want to destroy it. And by then you'll have noticed that they're trying to run out, giving you enough time to kill them. There's Claymore spots on coastline. So if you're trying to attack Hooker Lounge Objective from outside balcony, a common run out for defenders in that area is Sunrise Bar Entrance. Normally what I like to do when attacking Hooker Bar is I like to drone in with my Twitch drone and try to destroy gadgets like Jaeger ADSs and Malusis. Normally where I like to sit, so it can't be seen from anywhere, is on the stairs going up to the balcony. And I need a claymore to cover that in case one runs out from Sunrise Bar Entrance. So what you can do with this claymore is place it on top of the little pebbles on the left hand side of the door and make it so the laser is pointing inwards to the door frame. This makes it so the defender running out might not even be able to step outside before the claymore sets off. So as you can see, the defender hardly had to run out before getting blown up by the claymore. This next claymore is on border. And yes, this is before the rework, but that doesn't matter because this part of the map doesn't change in any way. If you're trying to attack customs inspections and supply room, this window is a very common run out if you're trying to look from outside, especially if you've planted on the window in the supply room and you're watching the diffuser. One thing you need to make sure of though is that you don't put the claymore right in front of the drone hole so defenders can shoot it. And as you can see, the claymore isn't visible from the drone hole. The final claymore in this video is going to be on Villa. So if you're attacking aviator room and games room from balcony and you're wanting to enter through study, you want to make sure no one is flanking you from 90 hallway into study. A good way of placing this claymore down is on the right hand side of the door with only one laser showing. You can do this by placing the claymore at about a 30 degree angle, making it so it's less visible for the defender. Well, this is the end of this part of the video. If you want to see the part two of this video, make sure to be subscribed and turn notifications on to know when it comes out. 
and I guess that's about it. Peace.